Blockbuster was an entertainment company that was a household name from the late 80s to the early 2000s. They carried movies, video games, and music for people of all ages to rent. Walking up and down the aisles at Blockbuster to look for a movie everyone could enjoy or maybe check out the new selections section became an unspoken weekend tradition for many families across America. In 1997, Reed Hastings, a Silicon Valley veteran, was inspired to start Netflix by his frustration with a $40 late fee charge he received from Blockbuster for returning a movie after its scheduled return date. He entered the market of movie rentals with a new business model concept, subscription-based rentals. Customers would pay a flat monthly rate to select as many movies as they wanted and return them whenever they were done. The company devised algorithms to give viewers suggestions on which movies they might enjoy based on previous selections. This concept did more than just tweak the business model of their competitors. It flipped an entire industry on its head. Netflix emphasized looking ahead to the future of the industry by incorporating innovation and technology into its process. This is the impact of leaders stepping back and making sure they have a vision for their organization, to be able to recognize future challenges and opportunities that may present themselves and not get left behind. In 2000, Netflix approached Blockbuster with a proposition to buy them out for $50 million, but Blockbuster refused that or any other kind of deal. Instead, they focused money and resources on their inventory and creating a positive in-store experience for their customers. They were at the height of their power and viewed Netflix's attempts to modernize the industry as a fad. Unfortunately, their leadership didn't have the vision to see how their disregard for improving their product would be their eventual downfall. In 2007, Netflix switched its primary business model from a DVD rental subscription to a streaming service. With this move, its customer base grew by 20% that year, taking more of the market share. Blockbuster realized too late, due to its leadership's lack of vision, that it was now dealing with an emergency as its customers increasingly depended on a competitor for their movie needs. In fact, Blockbuster even attempted to create its own online platform, but was too far behind at that point. The effort faltered and Blockbuster went bankrupt in 2010. Netflix has gone on to not only revolutionize video rentals, but alter how people view media overall. The company has grown from solely providing movies and TV shows to producing them. Netflix has produced award-winning movies like Marriage Story, Don't Look Up, and Roma, although they are probably even more famous for their hit TV shows like House of Cards, Stranger Things, The Queen's Gambit, Daredevil, and Squid Game. By creating this content, Netflix has become a cultural pillar for millions of people and has set itself up to become the primary source of media entertainment for many around the world. By the end of 2017, they had over 130 million subscribers and were operating in 190 different countries around the world. The leadership at Netflix understood how vision is a key component for staying relevant in a time when circumstances are changing rapidly. Those organizations with plan-oriented, forward-thinking leaders will be able to stay ahead of potential issues instead of panicking as they appear. In any organization, the importance of having a visionary leader cannot be overstated. A leader's ability to craft and communicate a compelling vision for the future is crucial for the long-term success and sustainability of the organization. While visions may not always lead to instant success, their value lies in the long-term impacts they can have on shaping the organization's direction, fostering innovation, and empowering its members to seize future opportunities. By defining a compelling vision, leaders inspire their people and align them towards a common goal. This shared understanding fosters unity, collaboration, and a sense of belonging among your people. When everyone is working towards a shared vision, individual efforts become more purposeful and cohesive, leading to improved performance and outcomes. A well-crafted vision acts as a guiding beacon, helping the organization navigate through challenges and uncertainties. This vision enables leaders to anticipate potential obstacles, adapt to market dynamics, and make informed decisions that align with the long-term goals of the organization. By having a clear sense of direction, leaders can avoid reactionary decision-making and instead proactively steer the organization towards success. Additionally, a visionary leader stimulates innovation within the organization. By articulating a forward-thinking vision, leaders inspire their employees to think creatively and explore new ideas. A vision that emphasizes growth, progress, and adaptability encourages individuals to challenge the status quo, experiment with novel approaches, and embrace change. This mindset of innovation fosters a culture of continuous improvement and keeps the organization at the forefront of industry trends, enabling it to seize emerging opportunities and stay competitive in a dynamic marketplace. A vision provides a framework for future-oriented decision-making. Leaders who have a well-defined vision can make strategic choices that align with the long-term interests of the organization, rather than being swayed by short-term gains or fads. By considering the long-term impacts of their decisions, leaders can make choices that are consistent with the organization's core values and objectives. A visionary leader empowers their team to seize opportunities that have not yet presented themselves. By painting a vivid picture of the organization's future, leaders inspire
inspire their people to think beyond the present and explore uncharted territories. All right, I have a challenge for you from today's lesson. I want each of you to answer the question, do you have a current, well-crafted vision for what you expect your organization to achieve? Do your people know that vision? Make sure to put your answer in the comments so that we can all learn from each other. Till next time, keep on learning. Thank you for watching. Much of what I go over in my lessons can be found in my book, Mission First, People Always, which is available for purchase through the link in the description of the video. If you enjoyed today's video and want to watch more leadership lessons, then be sure to like the video and subscribe to the channel.